la 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 Show Galaxy Themes and Music Productions Ara ba ni baba o Eni aba la ba ni baba o Eba ni ti waba kwa neva Ishe wa ma tek tu Bang ba gidi ba la do ro bo kwe ni to ti ba wa do wo kwa No ma wipe Ishe ti wa ya to Supernatural How far your IT presentation all is well? That's the reason why I'm not fine. Do you know the IT present it didn't go where her thought and I really need to talk to you concerning it. Oh the matter is so frustrating now, I'm so tired. Just calm down, everything will be alright. You sorry. said you come to my place yesterday now. Oh, I'm so so sorry. I couldn't make it again yesterday. We came back very late from the villages we went to. And when I came back, I was very stressed out already. I will come to your place immediately I leave this prayer meeting. Okay, I'll be expecting you. We really need to talk. And eh? expecting you, please make sure you come. I'll come, I'll come. Hey, then I want us to be more prayerful. In this time, I want us to be more vigilant. His promises stand sure. Yes. Remember Isaiah 43 and Ephesians chapter 1. Verse 4 down to 6. Yes. Those promises stand show. We are that generation that take places for him. Yes. We are chosen for his glory. Oh, yes. We are called for his glory. Oh, yes. 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 This is what we talk in Jesus' name. Yeah. I don't want us to be weak. No, yes. I don't want us to be tired at all. You understand? Let us keep looking unto him. The author and finisher of our feet. And I pray his promises will come to pass in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. This man again. Isn't the only man on campus? What is wrong with him? My presentation is next week. 
And do you believe this man is here to sign my reports? I even went to his office today and all he was saying is I must agree to his own proposal. Eh? Ah. Ah, and I told him that I can never sell my own body to anybody because Christ has already purchased me. Of course. Of course. Oh, 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 was to no avail, eh? Everything just went on deaf ears. Eh? Jesus. And, and you know that if if he doesn't sign the report, there's no way I'll do my presentation. Yes, ma'am. Eh? And that's it, eh? Yes. I'm so worried. He just calm down. And, and, and eh, I don't even know how he got to know you because he asked me of you. Ask of me? For mm -hmm. what? I don't know. See, Esther. Try and go there tomorrow. You sign in by God's grace. Try and go tomorrow. I said I went to his office today. I even blasted him before leaving his office. Eh? And you know that man is the kind of person that he can do all things to get anything. You shouldn't have blasted him now. That's not good. He's not good as a child of God. What did he say? Go there tomorrow. You sign it. He's just a mere man before my father. He has no other option than to go do it tomorrow. Good day. And cheer up. I don't know if it's because of you, something like that. Cheer up, Joe. Everything will be fine. I'm assuring you. Okay. I'll go. I'll go tomorrow. I just love this your kind of strong faith, eh? Okay. That's why I love you. It's alright, it's alright. And don't worry, God will continue to strengthen you. Amen, from... amen. amen. I'll go tomorrow. Try and go, try and go. And I've eaten. I was coming back from class when I called you the other time. And because of the issue, I've not even been able to cook or anything. And besides, I don't even have food stores. My food stores are finished. Hey, yeah, sorry. I'm really, really sorry. We came back very late from the villages we went to. And the little money I was able to gather over the weekend, I used to transport our workers and bring them to that place. So the many chain left, I used to get to this small store. Just manage it over the week. Thank you. I'm really grateful. You're welcome. You're welcome. So, ah, 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 food is ready like this now. Let me quickly prepare something so we can eat before you. Don't worry, don't worry, never mind. I need to be on my way. It's very late already. Let me be on my way. Let me be on my way. Some other time. I need to get some things going on. Alright. It's alright. Lest I forget. I don't want us to forget Pastor Gadi in our prayers. Alright. You know, it's over a year now since he left for South Africa. I've not heard anything from him ever since. Let us continue to pray for him. I pray the Lord is going to keep him anywhere he is. Amen, amen. And I believe the Lord is going to send another person amen. to help us very soon. Amen, amen. I even believe all things are working together for our good, eh? See you tomorrow. Today. I'm doing very well, and you? I'm fine too. All right. I like your outfit though. It looks very nice on you. Thank you very All right. much. Okay, bye -bye. All right. Okay. Bye bye. Right. Esther. Hmm. Let's say forget. What's that? Oh, Doctor Jishafe has signed the IT report. Ah uh ah. -uh. Hmm. How did you know about that? I think we don't know how things are going on in this department. Hmm. Unless I forget, don't forget that today is the deadline. And if you fail to sign, hey, it's your own detriment, you know. And you know that's mad personality in this department. You know no one can swim. Hey, Esther, you know what? I will advise you, you know, to allow him to cast his implication on you. Hmm? So it's just for a limited time. God forbid! I will never sell my glorious destiny to anyone, even if others are doing it. Like you mean glorious destiny? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's wait and see. You know, I'm just coming from his office right now. You can see, if you see his continent, it was very, very terrible. Immediately I entered his office, he just sent me out without even listening to what I have to say. And I perceive you are the cause of the anger. I know. See, I would rather advise you not to go to his office right now because if you are not ready to accept his offer, I will just send you out. So I will advise you not to go. You know? That's all I have to tell you. We'll see you later. Alright, bye bye. I said, get up! I said, you're the one. Uh, 
actually before you came in I was disturbing some way but that's by the way. Oh how are you here? Um I've come for the um, signature of my IT report, sir. Oh. Oh. Um, first time. You can have your seat. You can have your seat. Alright. Um, um, extra. Thank you very much, sir. Hey, hi, hi. I never had a. Uh, I never had an intention of destroying your life, you know. of destroying your life and I'm not bad either you know um, thank you very much you're, you're welcome oh, Esther. Esther I can hear you sir you know I, I, I don't know how to put this never thought I had any even intention towards you Though you may see, you may see me as someone that is Esther. In short, let me just come in this way because I don't know how to put it. I've tried all I could to accomplish. I've tried all means, even as a Christian. I've read books, I've made several consultations, but you know, all I've proven about him. Esther, three years after my wedding, my wife left our only child just because of my unfaithfulness towards her. before and after. I've been battling with this just to come out of this hair, from this mess. All to know of So things yesterday, before you went to my office, you mentioned the issue of a man um, putting fire in his bosom. Something like that. Since yesterday, I've not recovered. Seriously, I've not recovered. Esther. Esther. I can hear you, sir. I want to ask you a question. Can I be changed? You really can be changed, sir. Oh, you can be changed. And it is only Jesus that can change you, sir. Because he has already told us in his word that his yoke is easy and his burden is light. So once you are just ready to, 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 to surrender yourself to him, he's able to deliver you, sir. He can and he will. Please pray for me. There's huh? not a friend. Oh, Jesus. Light alone, leave Jesus. Jesus. No, no. I've been trying his number since morning and it has not been going through. He actually called his roommate Frederick. Frederick told me he hasn't set his eyes on him since last night. 
And you know, Yojun doesn't act this way. Whenever he goes out, he always tells me. For some reason, I'm, I'm, I'm getting worried though. I don't know what's wrong. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. All right. Statement. I said, oh, Jesus still loves you. Even in, our, in your own ways. Even when the situation is that happens just now. I want you to know that even though the wind sends boisterous and stormy, since Christ is still in the boat, we will be wet. And do not forget, faithful is he that promised, Sister Esther. Just keep your mind at rest. God is on your side. Like, I'm just so tired of this. Eh? 
for Esther. You will be able to see that there is no how difficult it may be. There will be someone that will remain with one. We stand by one. Come on, Guru, Guru. Come on, Kenny. Come on. been studying Hebrews chapter 11 okay so from this verse 6 mm -hmm. I realized that faith is very important in the life of a Christian okay because it says but without faith it is impossible to please him for he that cometh to God must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him yes that's very correct and you see, while reading all through that chapter, you see the success recorded by those men is as a result of their unwavering faith in God. Mm -hmm. Through faith and holding tight to the word of God, they were able to overcome every challenge and situation that confronted them. Mm -hmm. And they were able to obtain the promise through that. So faith is very vital. That's good. Mm -hmm. That's Any good. other thing or are we good to go? Um... I'm actually studying the old chapter. Okay. So let me see. Okay. This verse 25. It's talking about Moses. And let, let me read what it says. Choosing rather to suffer affliction with the people of God than to enjoy the pleasures of sin for a season. You know, mommy, Moses counted all the enjoyment of this world and that of the house of Pharaoh as dung just to gain your work with God. What a great man he did. Little wonder God used him for the deliverance of all the Israelites. Yes, my dear. And from that verse, there is a lesson you should learn from there. That see, no matter the situation you find yourself, nothing should take the place of God in your life. No matter the situation you find yourself. And I will repeat that. I mean nothing. No matter what it is. To take the place of God in your life. Hold on to that which you have been Hold fast to that which you have been laid. Okay. Uh, come. Yadu. Yadu, come back here. Come back here. Just look at the kind you are coming in. Hmm? You've been out since 9 a.m. this morning. And you are just coming back by this time. I didn't know you. Mommy, this is mommy. unfair. See, mommy. Hmm? I don't have time to answer all those questions. I'm not in the mood. We all have our lives to live. I'm over. This is just to think. When, when Bishop Stan was speaking, he was encouraging us. You can know about someone when you read his books, study about him, but you know the person when you encounter him. Hallelujah. There is a difference between knowing the word and knowing the author. Hallelujah. How many of you truly desire to know the Lord? I will lift my voice and I will sing. At this time of the day, so eh, how many times have I warned you? Eh, how many times have I warned you not to pray? Or I don't want to hear any message again in this house. Sorry, Esther, you are beginning to disobey me seriously, sorry. and I will not take it easy with you. And I mean it this time around. I will not take it easy with you. You are nonsense. Yeah, you are welcome. And that was what we did. That was what we did. Tolu, you need to be careful with me in this house. You need. To be very very careful with me 
In this house. Okay, okay, I've had it. I have also told her, eh? Esther, go inside. Won't you go to school tomorrow? Eh? Go and sleep. Yeah, I'm sorry. Can you just. Okay. See, just look at the time you are coming. There. You don't come earlier than this. But now you are coming home very late. It is, it is not okay. Eh? So, you are telling me that I'm coming home late now, Abby? Okay. Eh? Do you have any home chores to give to me? Woman, warn yourself. Warn yourself. And I mean it. Okay, go and freshen up. Just leave your bag and me... See, you need to be careful, or else I will ban you and your daughter from going to church again. Perform my good work towards you in causing you to return to this place. Ah, Lord, you will visit this family. Ah, Father, you will visit this family. Just like you visited Abraham. Ah, Lord, this family needs visitation. Divine visitation from above. Ah, Lord, you will heal this family. You have said in your word that you will heal my life. Lord, you will heal this family, Lord. Let this family never be desolate. Ah, Lord, let this family be called people. Ah, Lord, you will heal this family. In the name of Jesus. And the one said the thought you have towards this family is the thought of good and not of evil, Lord. Let your will be done in this family, God. Let your will be done in this family, Lord. Enough of the devil taking control of this home. Enough of the devil being the president of this home. And Lord, let your will be done. any of my things, but she will not listen. I kept 1,000 on my table before going out yesterday. Now I can't find it anymore. I'm going to say that I want to be touching any of my things. Oh. You do, I am sorry. I'm sorry. I was the one that took the money. When I sent Esther to the market and the money I gave her was not enough, so I just had to take it. Mommy. And I entered your room, but you were not there. Mommy. But you didn't tell me you were going out. Hmm? Me, mommy, you should not have touched any of my things now. I also need the money. I'm sorry. At least if you want to take something like that, you should have told me. Thank you, know, my I'm sorry, I'll give you back tonight. Family. Amen. The family is fine and we are all doing well. And it has been the grace of the Lord that has been sustaining my husband. Thank you very much, sir. Well, I, I please go for that. I please go for that. Please, this is my colleague. I pray that your family will continue to work strong in the Lord in Jesus' name. Amen. And, uh, you know, more importantly, I'm just telling you that please continue to pray for your family. Whenever you think the Lord is not hearing you, it does, of course. I just want to take on God bless you. Amen. Thank you very much, Pastor. in this house. If you are left, that is the gun. Esther, if you are left, that is the gun. Come here. 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 Come here.
What? She's my daughter and I have a business. I'm so only daughter for God's sake. Do you not pray again in this house? <laughs> and you've refused to listen to me. Tolu, you need to be careful with me. Or else I will wipe all of you out of my house. What sort of nonsense are you performing with me? Have you been wrong with everything? I'm asking you. My dog. My dog. Tolu, be careful with me in this house. Oh, this is oh, none of your business. Get out of this house. This is my business. This is my business. You are allowed to get me to see the way you're going. coming here at all and if I may say this is the first time I'm seeing you since the last two years madame has joined our church whenever I ask after you what she tells me is that you are doing well you are right sir this is uh, the fifth year of uh, moving to this area I will also commend you for the way you've been taking care of your family and I also say a very big thank you. I also beg you, if there's any way Madame has wronged you. See, women must behave like women. And that is why they are weaker versus. And God has given us the responsibility to be in charge. is as a result of the irresponsibilities of the one or the other one or even both of them. Mr. Bangkoli, I want to say so if there is any way Madame has around you. See, we are the head. And the Bible says in Genesis chapter 1 verse 26, when God says that let's make man in our image after our likeness, that they may have dominion over the fish in the sea, the fowl in the hay, and over all people things that creep it. See, this is what God is expecting from us. A glorious family, a glorious home, a home that will establish his kingdom. This is the purpose why God has established your home, sir. I know all of these things. I know them. Hmm. Mr. Bancoli, knowing is not enough. The many also prove they know that they find it difficult to carry this out. Mr. Bancoli, forgive your wife. If there's any way he has wronged you, Pastor, to, to be sincere and, uh, and candid with you, my, my wife has actually been a good wife. She has been very, very faithful and uh, loyal to me. But everything just changed, Pastor. Everything just changed, you see. I wasn't like this before. <laughs> I wasn't like this before, but when I began to face challenges, and I began to face some, some difficult circumstances, Pastor, I, I had no other option. See. I prayed. In fact, God failed to show up. He failed to show up and I had no option that to resort to looking for alternatives. And uh, see, it, it almost cost my life. In fact, Pastor. Hmm. Mm. Mr. Bankwili, hmm. I understand to some reasonable ways. But see, every true child of God must be tempted. They must face trials. The book of James chapter 1 verse 4 says, we will fall into diverse temptation. He said we should can't eat for joy 
Why? Because our faith that is being tried, we produce the glory of God. See, I don't want to know what you know, you, you've done. But more importantly, what I want you to know is that God is still interested in this family. He wants to de be the master planner of this home. But sir, if only you give him time. I've realized my faults. I've seen my flaws. All you just need to do for me now is, is to pray for me. Pray for me. I, I, I need to change. Son, I have recognized there have been such an irresponsible father to you. You see, I've, I've seen my mistakes and I've seen my flaws. But nevertheless, I just want to tell you that there is still hope for you. See, according to that book of Lamentation, chapter 3, verse 27, which says, it is good for a man to bear his yoke while he is still young. And uh, it says further that the glory of the youth is in their strength. You don't need to give up at this time. All you just need to do is concentrate on God. See, there is still space for you in the sky. And I know that you shall excel. All you just need to do is come closer to God and surrender your life to God. That's all. Daddy, you killed the passion of God in my life. I finished secondary school four years ago. But because of what you faced, you hindered me from progressing. You left us to cater for our needs and left me to fend for myself. <laughs> my brother Isaac, that is even studying in South Africa today. It's nothing you know about. You see, my son, I'm still assuring you. I'm still assuring you that you can make it. See, there is possibilities for you. I'm telling you, the only thing you just need to do is just recognize God. And you will see, my son, it is well with you. You shall be great. <laughs> That was how God restored my family. <laughs> and we started enjoying the covenant of peace that God has promised us. <laughs> my father started performing his responsibilities as a father. <laughs> my family was back to normal again. <laughs> I and my brother even took jump from that very year. In the next five minutes, I will change the screen from Zoom. Uh, my, 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 Okay now. Okay, okay. Wow! <laughs> 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 oh, mommy! Daddy, you need this thing. Yes, yes, my dear. What's that? <laughs> the admission list for, for my university is out. Really? And my name is on the list. Wow! <laughs> wow! 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 Wow!
have been given admission I, to study petroleum engineering. Oh my God! This is good. This is good. You are worthy to be priest. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Ade, Esther, both of you have gained admission yes. into university. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Wow, wow. Yes. God, God has been so good. Um, I know your mother might have been suspecting, but uh, what happened? See, in the next two months now, mm -hmm. okay, your brother Isaac is coming back home. <laughs> from oh, 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 God. 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 Your son is coming back home. Yes. 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 Oh, Thank you, brother. <laughs> It's it calls for celebration. It's it's really it's it's so daddy. It calls for celebration. Oh, yes. so yeah, thank God. I'm happy too. Thank you. The both of us are now yes. on that ground. Yes. Yes. I did get it. Goes, how he healed me to the uttermost when I think about the Lord. How he picked me up and turned me around. How he placed my feet. On solid ground When I think about the Lord How He saved me How He raised how me How He filled me oh, With the yes. Holy Ghost How He healed me To the earth When I think about the Lord How He saved me before anybody eats, let us do, okay? Let's close our eyes. Father, we thank you for this meal that you have provided for us. We say you will bless it and sanctify it that it will nourish our body. In Jesus' name, we are free. Amen. Amen. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> What's wrong with Isaac? <laughs> ah, Isaac, go no problem. Daddy, daddy. <laughs> So you mean you giving yourself to this superstition and human ideology called religion? Ah, hey, what do you mean? Ah, it's just a great wonder to me. You have even allowed mommy to brainwash you. Ah, I don't understand. <laughs> I was, because I was wondering, how you were coming from airport, your communication with me has totally changed. Different from the daddy I knew. It's been gone. Life is not static now. Change is inevitable, so... Things has to change, wow. my son. Wow. Uh, Brother Isaac, it's like you don't know what's up. Mm -hmm. Jesus is now the center of this family. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes, bro. We are now like a tree planted by the rivers of water. They are bringing forth its fruit in the season. Whatsoever it do it, shall prosper. Um, 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 I, I think it's okay for now. You see, uh, after the meal, you can continue your. Okay, let us finish this food first. But well, sincerely, mom, I really enjoyed this meal. It's just so wonderful. And I hope I'll be able to eat more of this often. Thank you, dear. Now that you are home, you will enjoy more home cooking. Wow, wow. Mm? I will sure, love sure. Esther. I hope you have mommy with all of these in the kitchen. Of course. Mm, we did it together. <coughs> what happened? <coughs> what happened? Mm. Esther, Esther. Continue. I will continue. Mm. As if we can cook. Mommy, what now? I didn't eat your food. Hmm? Mm. <laughs> Daddy. Yes, dear. Um, Tonight is the zonal video for youth. So I don't know if you could just take us in your car and you come back immediately. I remember that you have a VG this evening, but uh, you see, I won't be able to take you. Mm. I need to rest. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. I need to rest. So you go by a commercial bus. Eh? Sorry, dear. Okay, no problem. It's okay. Bro, you come along. Me. It promises Me. to be very powerful. Me. So it has even downgraded to that to the extent of you guys going to be. Yeah, this is serious. Esther, you and Alina, you can go for the video. Mm? Leave Isaac in there. You know he just returned from the journey. Mm. So just allow him rest. I won't even mm. follow you. I can't follow you. VG. Uh, oh, no problem, no problem. So you and Adin you should go together. Mm? It's okay. You're rising. You'll be 
That was funny. <laughs> Look at you. You are not serious. You are not serious. I remember something. What is that? And I want to tell you. Do you know that I'll be going for my service here before you? <laughs> oh, my God. Ah, ah. Look at your body. You've forgotten that I'm your father anytime, anyway. Mm, father, indeed. And it has my prayer that has answered over you. Mm. Be careful. Mm. I'll be careful. We're all will be well, let's start. Amen. We pray that the Lord take us to our safe home. Amen. And give us safe land in Jesus' name. Now that Isaac is even around, mm -hmm. he's going to give me his iPad. His iPad? Mm -hmm. He promised he's going to give me the iPad. Now what's wrong with you? The only daughter. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Mom, we have to. Your sister at this point in time. Yes, Pastor, I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Now that our family members has taken over the little properties that we have left, how then are we to take up and cater for our needs? How to take care of ourselves? Even those we look up to, thinking they'll be there for us now that our parents are no more. They are even the ones that chase us out of their house. It's God that will judge. Because they know that even when my mother was alive, she had no relative with her. Okay. I felt disappointed as well. But let's just leave her to God to do what the place is in. That is by the way. Hadi Yoju, yes. you told me this week is the deadline. You, you were told to resume to school. Yes. Have you been able to make the payment? Not at all, sir. I was able to guide down some amount of money during the weekend. But I discovered that I can only cater for one person. So I decided to reject my admission for now. While I sponsor uh, Estire's education. I'm going to engage myself in some many jobs for the meantime. So the little money I'm able to gather, I'll use it to cater for our needs and cater for Esther's education too. And then you do. You are indeed a man. I love that courage. But see, I wouldn't want you to withhold that admission. I will cater for both of you. 
Let me engage myself in the job. Uh, we'll be able to manage, Daddy. Yes, please, sir. I don't want to stress you. you. Woman, you understand. See me as your father. You are not free. Be free with me. You can just come into my house. You are my children, indeed. But see, Adi Yoju, the law has purpose of sending you to that institution. Mm. And see. What I will just tell you is that you should hold on to these promises. Remember the revelation I, I share with you. When you got the admission offer, I mean before yeah. the date of your marriage. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. See, many people have these promises also. But whenever they get to the institution, they just live their life the, the way it pleases them. And at the end of the day, they will live an unfulfilled life. And it reverses their case. And they have wasted all what the Lord has deposited in, in them. But see, I pray you soon be like that. Amen. Amen. Okay. Pastor has been the one taking. All our responsibilities ever since. He gave us everything that we needed. Even those things we didn't expect him to give us. God really used them for us. To the extent that we did not have any reason to feel the absence of our parents. We actually thought we had reached our safe haven. Not until about a year ago, when we heard that he has been transferred to another country. What? Wow. <laughs> and we never heard from him ever since. Mm -hmm. Since then, that was when it became done on us that we still have much journey ahead. And then you just been the one taking up my responsibility since then. <laughs> it was the only one I looked up to. <laughs> and now he's no more. I can't find him. And you're telling me to eat. <laughs> you're telling me to cheer up. <laughs> Does God even love me? <laughs> ah, Esther, there you go. God still loves you. I know he is with you in every high and stormy day. Our anchor holds behind the veil. I know that he is going to see you through all these challenges. The Bible says that though our outward man perish, our inner man is renewed day by day. Esther, God is going to see you through all this. Amen. And all this will become a testimony Amen. in future time. Just have faith. Esther, Esther, God is in control. And I know wherever your brother is now, he's safe and secured. Eh? Esther. Esther. See, I perfectly understand your predicament. Esther. I also face similar situation. But I stay through. I'm very sure that you too is stay through. Hmm? Before the week runs out, make sure you will see me in the office. Alright? Are 
you sure you are fine? Hmm? Come on, I told you. I still being worried about this issue. Hmm? Um, actually, uh, there is no how one would not be worried anyway. But just don't be too worried. Hmm? You know your exams you know, are quite impending. And you can't afford to prepare for your exam anyhow. Hmm? Esther, put your heart together. I mean, put your heart together and come out with good grades. Hello, Esther. Yes, sir. Esther. Esther. Come on, cheer up. I want to see you smile. I mean, smile always. As from now. I want you to see me as a father. Hmm? Sister Esther, just sit down, sit down, sit down. See, I'm here for something very, very important. Really? Actually, God sent me to you. There's nothing more to do. Ah, so? Uh -huh. But I had a dream last night. And it was, it terrified me a lot. I saw you. a man deceiving you. And as the man was deceiving you, you kept following the man. So you start walking in a mud. With you, seriously, in your beauty. But the amazing fact there is that as we are walking in the mud, joke with this man, I saw another man behind. He appears. Trying to beckon on you, calling to seriously, sister Esther. As we are walking with this man. I noticed the man calling you back with passion. <laughs> Sister Esther, she, he disappeared. But now you kept on walking in this mud. Highly yoked with him. Later you begin to cry aloud. Cry for help. But the man you were walking with in the mud, the only thing he could do was that he burst into laughter and start making mockery of you. You kept on crying for help. That was when I woke up. Sister Esther, as I was ruminating over this dream, these verses of scripture dropped in my mind. Second Corinthians chapter 6, verse 14 to 15. You can open along with me. You can open along with me. If you don't have it here, you might not worry. Yeah, let me just use my phone. Let me... Okay, that'll be better. That'll be better. Second Corinthians chapter 6, verse 14 to 15. Okay, I'm there. Nice. Be ye not unequally joke together with the unbelievers. For what fellowship has righteousness with unrighteousness? Communion as the light has to do with the darkness. Continues in verse 15. It says, And what concord at Christ with Belial? Hmm. Or what part at he that believeth with an infidel? 
this nice guy. Ruminating on this, I asked the Holy Spirit for interpretation and revelation. He gave me the interpretation and revelation. <laughs> and he told me to tell you, Sister Esther, the Holy Spirit is seriously warning you because you have unknowingly entered into a relationship which is leading to something serious. But Sister Esther, <laughs> to be sincere with you, I don't know what relationship it has been. I don't know how far you've gone. But what the Holy Spirit told me to tell you is that <laughs> He is seriously warning you, Sister Esther. Seriously warning you to be careful. To be careful. So as not for you to enter into the snare of the enemy. That's all. That's all. All right, brother Samson. Thank you very much. Thank God. Thank I'm God. really very grateful that you shared this dream with me. And I'm also going to pray about it. That will be nice. I'll seek the face of the Lord concerning it. And I know there will be clarity by God's gifts. Amen. 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 Thank you Amen. so much. I'm grateful. Don't worry, Sister Esther. I will also pray along with you. Oh, thank you. I will pray along with you. Thank you. And I know I was well. Amen. Amen. But do not forget the one of the Lord. What does it mean by this? Relationship. I'm not even in any relationship, am I? Ben, <laughs> I know. Only pay Sorry, Latin or you worry the lesson. When you die, then be quite your donor. Ki ya go na fi Ah, I dey yah do my dey yah do. Oh, so funny. Come on, go. Ni ba ti anu sobia. 
to gbe ba mi dale ni gba o asite won ba mi o te tan ah ma se o gbogbo awon olorun 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 ti baba mi pari wo kiri awon san go ni o obata la ni o oya ni o gbogbo won ta pe 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 e ba wo le mi fun ami o gbe tan ko si ele ti o gbo nbe gbogbo awon olorun won kan le ti ni won fi gba won o gbo won awon tan si won kankan sugbon sori lo gan ka de yan jugbon si ofre o kan de we iwe kan to sori we to gbe dani iwe to gbe dani bi bi eli o se yo da fun bo to ni baje fun o tori iwe o o kan ka ko jo pe eyan ka ya jo o fo gede o kan sa ka dugbe mo ra won lo mu mo ra won to si poruko jesu pere bayi lara ba mi da o o jo mi loju iba fun ke ki to gbagbe eh sakunda o ri pe ko si lenu dumo lenu jo meta sakunda sakunda we we re ti o re ti mo le wa ta ba lo mo mi o ti pe ti mo ti de jodo iwo lo lo a de yan ju ti wo sakunda san ko se bebe nu lu bi o se bebe o se bebe a so fun pe gbogbo awon ifa ti nbe ni inu ilu iluwa e lo be ni tan gbe la fi oba gbogbo won ko ta ta la de yan ju ti wa su fun ta ti fa ye won fun jesu eh bo se poruko re jesu gbogbo won pada na ti faye won fun jesu koda mo gbo pe oba o da duki are si merin o fun adeyanju ni eyo kan ni be lo to ni da kan adeyanju po o o ni emi mi emi emi mi mo nje o ye ni o ye wa o ye ni da da yo dara fun lo ko jesu amen amen ase ibi ta fi adagboro ni si ni ilu ni je ni ke ninu yin ni ibere Kaito, you need baby. You got tea and cow and all. And that will call be calling you baby. Any you will, you will call lo, you will call lo. Call lo say no. Oh, you will call lo say no. But I have a key. Must it be so funny? Tell me, me she passed up. How do you do lo call me? You buy to no, you buy. Eh, me buy to no, me ah. Oh, you see what? Eh, iwe kolo se, kolo se, kolo se. Ni nuwe kolo se. Ori keta, ese kidi. Eni kiyama ne pa onti oru. Kiyama se ne pa onti aye yi. Mba ti e don kwa lo wo. Eni kwe kiya bojo asoki si Jesu ni konsusu. Ti se ala shekwe iba gwa. E do so wipe ki a ma se se ani yan nipa ohun ti aye yi be bo je ohun ti a o je ni abi ohun ti a o mu sugbon paito bo ni gbogbo ohun ti e wi fun awon bo ni o se 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 ejo esalaye fun mi be ni fakile o se se o se se do seri jesu ni agbara lati pe se ohun ohun ti a ba bere owo re ตุ้ยนี่ปาร์ตี้คุณบุญบุญนิชิชิตาชิงเกะคนยากาลุสโอ้ส่งไปเป็นคนเทียนิลุนิลัตติเบรียตุ้ยคนเทียบาร์เบ
and to destroy. Verily, verily, I say unto you, He that entereth not by the door into the sheepfold, but climbeth up some other way, the same is a thief and a robber. Hello? Um, there's no problem. I'm sorry, sir. I, I just woke up from sleep, so I'm trying to meditate on some things. Oh. I don't think I'll be able to come today. Um, maybe some other time, sir. Surprise package. What's that, sir? I've been feeling since Monday. I don't mm. know, seriously. There's this heavy and consistent pain that I've been feeling in my stomach. Ah. It's always very. I was even thinking it's just normal stomach pain that when it comes, it will go and it will not come back again. But this mm. one, whenever it starts like this, eh, it's always very heavy to the extent that I can't do any other thing. You didn't eat ah. something serious. No, even if I'm reading like this, I'll have to stop that reading because the pain is always very heavy. Ah. That's I don't serious. know what to do. It's always very great, then, eh, friend. I don't know. Mm. No wonder. So I've been looking at you these days. I've been watching ah. you, the way you just react, the way you move, you walk. I've been wondering that what's happening. See. This is, you know, our exams are starting very soon and you need to actually look into this. Ah, this is why now you are we if exactly. if it is rounding up our CGPA. Ah, please, oh, we've really tried, we've come a long way. Please look mm. into it before the exam starts. In fact, I am very happy mm. seeing the last semester in this school. After so four good years of study. Ah, I'm very glad though. I'll finally I can't, finally I, be can't done I can't wait to even leave this school. I'm really tired of this school right now. I can't mm. wait to start doing this. Okay. I remember my brother, Esther. By the way, have you been to the school place? You can go in there. I'm not been there, John. Ah, you need to go there now. In fact, we have maybe like two hours to our lectures, eh, to our next lecture. You can quickly go and come back. Okay. But well, even if I'll go, I'll, I'll have to get to my room to get the training car. Clinic. Um, the clinic. I went to the clinic. Yes, I went to the clinic. Um, um, okay. He, he ran some tests on me, and the result confirmed that I have I have a stomach disorder called um, gastroparesis. Yes, yes. He, he actually gave me some drugs, and he he also asked me to rest. Yes, thanks for your concern. The passages I'm drawing your attention to. I have found David. When I saw the Bible say, I have found. Do you know the meaning of that? It means God searches for a man. It means that heaven searches that. for yes, someone yes. to use. How far about the tree to plant going God for searches for someone to raise. I have found David. The tree is scheduled to oh, two weeks from now. Okay. I pray God will grant you Johnny mercy in Jesus' name. In but really, don't you think it's really a very, very far distance from here in Maduguri down to your states? It is very, very far. 
We are even surprised when the Lord asks us to go to a place as far as that place. But there's nothing we can do. We just have to obey His voice. He believes He's taking us to higher ground. Mm. Although I told you I've been there before, seven years ago. Yeah, you told me that. that. I remember the word you did tell me. That all things are working together for our good. I pray it's yes. going to prepare the mind of these ones to receive from you. Amen. Amen. Thank you very, very much. When did the doctor ask you to come for the antenatal check-up? That's on Friday. On Friday? Yes. Then you should go very early. Then. Yes, but well, I would like you to come for the family. Yeah, I won't be able to go with you. Please, please you have to follow me. Oh, just try and understand. Just do this for me. Please. It's okay. I'll Thank go with you. Thank you so much. And I love you. I love you too. <laughs> So you are still alive. <laughs> so you've been alive all this while. And there I was, thinking you were no more. Thinking I've lost you forever. <laughs> if not for a friend that invited me for this program. And I reluctantly accepted to come. That's the way you would have gone on with your life. Forgetting that you have a sister. <laughs> what you did is very unfair and unbelievable. You are even the cause of all this mess that I am into now. Yeah. And I won't forgive you. I will uh, never uh, forgive you. Uh, uh, Esther. <laughs> I say I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You see, I, I tried to locate you. But I could not. See, in my attempt to locate you, I go to the house you stayed while on campus. But they say you were no longer there. Because you were true with your education by that time. See, Esther. My journey today is a long story, and if not for God's grace, that brought us together at this time. Mm, Esther, it is really, really a long story. But if I may ask, what led to this uh, unpalatable situation that you are talking about? And how did you go about your education without me? I'm sure God did send an helper, didn't he? Helpers, you said? I even wish I had not met any helper or no fake helper at all. I know my life would not have been this messed up. Really? You mean God did send an helper? Or oh, what do you mean? It's still better. Dr. G. Shafe. <laughs> Dr. G. Shafe. <laughs> Dr. G. Shafe. You seen Dr. G. Shafe? You remember him? Of course I do. <laughs> I remember him very well. What happened? It all started the day you went missing. According to our discussion the night before, I went to see Dr. Dishafe. And to my utmost surprise, he signed my report. He even confessed Christ that very day. On hearing about your sudden disappearance, he pretended to be my helper. Although I was warned by the Holy Spirit and even by some brethren around me, but I did not eat to the advice. Not until one day, when he enticed me to come to his house. I wish I could myself. Dr. Ajisha Fair Good. I cried all day in his room. But he did not even show any sign of remorse or guilt. You're a wicked man! <laughs> what have I done to deserve this from you? I trusted you! And this is how you repay me! <laughs> Ah! 
I actually went to the hospital earlier today and I was actually feeling stomach ache. But then, on getting to the hospital, I was told something else entirely. You can just see it yourself, sir. Actually, you know, I'm not a medical doctor. So, I didn't expect me to, you know, interpret the content of this report. Just tell me what is contained inside. Okay. Okay. Um, from the results here, it says I'm four weeks pregnant, sir. Four weeks pregnant? Yes, sir. Four weeks pregnant? Yes. So, what is that supposed to mean? Ah. Uh, um, sir. It means. You are the owner of the pregnancy and we need to find something to do about it. That's why I've come to seek you, sir. So that you can know what we we'll do about it, sir. Happen to you, <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> Doctor Jishafe. <laughs> I acted foolishly <laughs> by heeding to his advice of ab abortion. 
I did everything in secret. My close friends didn't know about it. Even the brethren in church didn't know about it. But I never knew I was only deceiving myself. <laughs> I was not sensitive to the spirit. Despite all the instructions that I received. <laughs> you know, I thought with all the care and money that I lavished on me that I have arrived at my safe heaven. But unknown to me <laughs> that it was only a fair heaven, a comfort in disguise. <laughs> Brother, things really went out of control after I finished school. There was nobody to encourage me, nobody to lead me aright. <laughs> and this really weighed me down from following the Lord. Today, I'm no longer to be reckoned with in the things of the Lord. <laughs> I have thrown away the joy of my salvation and have neglected my first love. <laughs> I missed it, brother. I missed it. <laughs> but, but, but. How did it disappear so suddenly? Where have you been all this while? I also demand an explanation from you. Esther, if no go for God's favor that found you, I will have been dead by now. Hey, yo, peace. <laughs> Blue. Hey. Oh, Lord, you know. Sit down, Marcus. Sit down, Marcus. Sit down, Marcus. Shut down. Shut down. Shut down. Shut down. Shut Calm down, calm down, calm down. Before we come out, time, man. Maybe we show the best picture of a send us. May you not say, no, be us kill you all. Bonnie, Bonnie, no show him. No show him. Don't forget to say, no one else us for rap. And by now, some things still not finish. No, 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 show him. No 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 Shut up! He told me like standing block! Like, like a block, eh? Find your way! Have you not lied? No, no, no! Come, Sam, Bonnie, come, Sam! Do this one! Yeah! Help me! Don't like him! Don't like Somebody him. help me, please! Help you with it! I, I want you to shoot you! Uh, I want you to shoot you uh, down! Ah! 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 Mugbe! Ha! I just shot you! Adi Shafé, you will continue to die million and billion of times it's on your way to eternal destruction. Ah, you shall rot in hell. You this man, it's ah, it's ah stop this man again. Stop cursing, ah. ah, Esther. Just calm down. You don't know what to do. I know, I understand. The same man. Calm down, ah, Esther. I don't want you to curse him now, and don't wish him any bad luck. <laughs> the Lord has vindicated us. And we are here today by God's mercy. It will even be my joy now if I can set my eyes on him and preach the good news of Jesus Christ to him. He has even reaped the result of his evil work. Because I heard that about two years ago he died of prostate cancer and that his death was a very horrible one. Really? You mean he died without Christ? Ha! Ah, Jesus. See, all is well. We thank God. We are here to give by his mercy. See, it's see, real. see. Hmm. Let's just leave that aside. Hmm. How did you now manage from those kidnappers to get away from them? See, my uh, escape 
still remains a mystery to me till now. Shut up, shut up. What did they do you say? Now you think you put the shadow to your top? What did they do you? I don't spat you. you. Maybe I put up your mouth. I don't know. Eh? Oh my God! Ah, God is wonderful. God is good. God, God is good. gracious. God is good. That was an uncommon favor, brother. Yes, it is. Ah, very uncommon. It is. That was great. See, that was just the beginning of my predicament. After I left the den of those kidnappers. I fell into another predicament, a totally different one. I started wandering the forest for like two days. Don't know where I was going or where I was coming from for about two days. I don't know where to head to, where to go, whether to turn to the right or turn to the left. Where am I even going? Oh, mess. Ah, oh, I've got it myself. Oh, God. God. Jesus, help me. Eh? What kind of mess have I found myself now? Eh? Oh, I don't know whether to go to the front or go to the back. Help! Somebody help me! Help! Somebody help me! Help! Il est mort, Loni! Et Joe, Baba! Baba, Joe! I am not a bomb, Louis! Et Joe! Il est mort, Louis! Hey Joe, and when nothing happened the ifa priest and the other priest challenged me but to no avail. When nothing happened, they threw me into a burning fire. <gasps> burning fire? Yes. I faced a lot of predicament and persecution from the powerful ones in that village. I spent almost five months in that village. I took nothing into that village. But the Lord used, used me to cause me to eat the good of that land. The Lord used me mightily in that village to set that village free from occultism and to lead the land from the snares of the wicked ones to his kingdom. Ah, thank you God. Mm. Thank you God. you God. Truly, many are the persecutions of the righteous, but the Lord saved them from them all. If not for God's grace, I wouldn't be here today. Even not for God's mercy. Ah. Mm. 
Glory to God. Glory to Jesus. It's okay. Everything will be alright. You see, I don't want you to trouble yourself at this time. I don't want you to be dismayed. Because you face the light affliction. I don't want that to weigh you down. And because of the little enjoyment you enjoyed, in your fear even, I don't want that to hinder you. But I want you to keep looking onto your Savior. The Good Shepherd, see, He is able to restore you and to give you that thing He has promised you. All I want you to do now is to surrender your life to Him. I want you to rededicate your life to Him. And it's going to restore you. It's going to restore the joy of your salvation. Just trust Him. It is well with you in Jesus' name. And you remember what I told you? That there must be a reason why God sent us to that place at that time. Yes, remember? Yes, yes, yeah, yeah. yes. Esther, come inside. Come inside. Come inside. Uh, before we go inside, I need, I need to do this introduction. Ah, okay. uh, my dear, this is Esther, my blood sister. Oh, yo, welcome. Ma. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Thank you. I'm fine. I give thanks to you. How is the journey? I'm fine. It was very fine. Ah, thank you very much, ma. Okay. And Esther, this is my sweetheart, my priceless gift. Yeah. We got married six months ago. Wow. And the, uh, she has really been a blessing to my wow. life. Wow, it's really nice meeting you, man. Nice meeting you too. <laughs> you see, since you told me about you yesterday, really bad, really bad. I've been longing to meet you. Really? Eh? So you are the one that stole my brother's hand. No, no, my dear. It's so good. It's so good. You really look pretty. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> and you too. Thank you, man. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. When your heart is weary and you feel like letting go, hold on to Jesus, He's your Say 